we're back now. Um, you know, I'm, I'm Taylor. Bro. And we're back from the store. So we're just gonna show y'all what we got and how much the totals were for both of us. We got separate things. You know, me and Taylor don't brush up and we do it together, but we, I get what I need, she get what she need. Yeah. And if we need something combined, then we just do it like that. It, like, yeah. So, <clears throat> I'm going to just say a little disclaimer. We don't shop like the normal college students. I um, mean, we don't talk about that. Like, we, we just don't. We plan out like the meals. <clears throat> and we the have week. a little stove and stuff to okay. actually cook it. Right. We plan our meals ahead of, ahead of time for week and go grocery shopping based on family meals. We don't really do a lot of snacking. We try to stay on the healthier like side. Like we don't get all that unnecessary junk food and stuff like that just because it costs too much and it adds up and there's no we don't need to know it. So yeah. so we're gonna start with the cold stuff. Oops. Because we can put that up. But this week. <laughs> We both got some bacon because like, no, we don't think there's no sense of sharing the bed because it's gonna get going quicker. So we just... We go through a pack of bacon by the weeks, every week. So yeah. there's no point. Same with eggs. We go through... Okay. This will probably last us like a week and a half. Yeah. Maybe. Yeah. But... So, yeah. Basically. So we just gonna put this up. I'm just gonna put mine to the side, y'all. I put my stuff in my refrigerator because four people sharing one refrigerator. I just want to free up some space. But the eggs were like a dollar forty-five. They were cheaper, and they be cheaper at different Walmart. We got this from Walmart, as y'all know. Um, the eggs was one forty-five, and the bacon was like three fifty-nine, I think. Three fifty-eight. Yep, three fifty-eight. Three fifty-eight. So that's that. Um, the other cold stuff. Chicken. Oh, we got yeah. I got a bag of boneless, skinless chicken breasts because you know we gonna make. Well, I'm gonna make fajitas this week. So yeah, we try to do a lot more chicken recipes. That's what we're trying to incorporate now instead of like. I mean, we still eat like red meat sometimes, but like not a lot. We're trying to do more chicken. And so the next day, we both got peppers. Yeah. So we got a lot of protein. Yeah. So I got a red pepper yellow pepper and a green pepper because I'm gonna do a little stuffed pepper recipe sometimes this week and I'm going to film that for y'all so stay on the lookout for that. And I just got the three colored peppers. I just didn't get a green one because like I said before, potatoes, yep. I got a tag of potatoes because potatoes don't go bad quick. Um, they're true. very versatile. Um, this bag was like four dollars, so it's kind of cheap for a bunch, bunch of these. Four five pound bag. Yeah, they last a while, so. How much were those? These were like they were four. Um, this was like four ninety nine. Yeah, four forty seven. Four forty seven. Salsa. I've never tried this salsa, but you know, we got this salsa for like the book, so yeah. Yeah, next, I got a cucumber because I try to like, if I get snacky, this will be like, I'm just gonna cut it up, eat it with some salad dressing, and there you go. Then I got some asparagus because I love asparagus. And it's easy, it's something real quick and easy to cook. I got some bananas. I only get two bananas because I use bananas for my fruit smoothie shakes. So I just cut them in half and use one half of them. And then I got some strawberries for breakfast and for my smoothies as well. Okay, next I got some chips. Oh yeah, it goes with my tuna. Also 
pull out for tools so I can have like a little snack and I give it some play. Quick and easy. And I'm gonna put that right there. <laughs> and then I got some school snacks because I eat these during class when I get hungry, like in the morning. I don't have time to cook breakfast in the morning before I go to class. I don't like to eat early like this. Yeah, I don't like to eat too early, so I just don't do that. So I have these to snack on when I get to class because I'll be like, mm, time to snack it now. Then I got some pancake mix and some syrup because if I get back from class after 11, I do get hungry. So I just make me a whole breakfast then. Mm -hmm. And then, y'all, we got a lot of rice. So this is a rice house one. Okay. Yeah. We got the boiling and the bag rice. Um, if y'all don't know about the boiling and bag rice, you need to eat with it. It's the easiest and quickest thing to cook it. I mean, it comes with like four packs of rice in here, so it, it lasts a long time. Maybe not for us because we go through it like water, but maybe for y'all a little. And then I got some beef rice because I ain't never seen beef rice and I wanted to try it. It looked kind of good. It did. So we're going to try that later on. Maybe not so soon later on. <laughs> and then Brianna got some cilantro lime rice. What do you think? This one? The side of the for you. There you go. And then I got some dirty rice because it's gonna go with our stuffed pepper recipe. So like I said, y'all need to stay on the lookout for that video because it'll be coming up maybe this week or next week, maybe sometime later on this week. That's that. Then we got some, this minced garlic and water because we add it with like just about everything we cook, every kind of like meat we cook. Honestly, anything I cook. Yeah, like on the potatoes, anything. Really just add that with that. I got some cranberry juice because I love the cream I love cranberry juice. I'm one of those girls. But I only like the 100 percent Well, I drink the other one, but I prefer I prefer the 100 percent cranberry juice because like it is more bitter, but to be honest, like I said before, cranberry juice is for the elite, period. <laughs> and then we just got some baking soda because it's good for cleaning, it's good for yourself, it's good for it's it's universal. It's very versatile. And yeah, you can use it for a lot of stuff. It's only good cents, so basically. Yeah, it was 52 cents. You cannot beat that. And then I got some Italian dressings, Italian the little mix. Italian season, it's not seasoning, it's Italian dressing, dressing mix. Seasoning mix yeah. So, I might do the video on that too, of what I use this for, because it's a quick and easy meal. I'm trying to show y'all quick and easy meals that you can do real quick and have for the rest of the week. Pretty much. And the last thing is the gros fajita mix, boy. Just to throw on top of the meat, season it up real quick. If you the type of uh, student that don't really have like a bunch of seasonings or y'all in the dorm room and don't have stuff like that, sis. Go buy that seasoner and I'll get you a couple packs of these seasonings. And just throw it yeah. on the food and that's it. Like, so that's really all the stuff we got. Um, I spent $45.94. So, yeah, this is this should last me between like this whole week and maybe half of next week before I have to actually like stop it. Yeah, yeah. And then for me, it was 42.36, but I went ahead and also got a couple of like personal items that I didn't like show because the personal items. But yeah, so about like, you know, honestly I spent like $35 on groceries, but that'll last me a week, like a week. And then I'll have to go back and get some more things or whatever, because like I said, I need more meals, stuff for meals. But yeah, that's basically it. Uh, if y'all like this video, let us know if you want to see more of these type of videos. Because we go to the store all the time. All the time. Like, I more can't you should it. <laughs> Today we went to the store. It's Sunday. Um, we'll probably be back on Tuesday. Um, we just might. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just might. But we're going to incorporate some more cooking videos. Because, like I said, the stuff that we got is not the typical stuff that, like, college students eat. We don't get, like... The frozen meals and the, the oodles and noodles and stuff yeah. like that. Noodles. My time with that is over with. I'm tired of eating that stuff. Um, yeah, it's not good for you. Yeah, I'm over it. So, 
more cooking videos definitely coming because yes, we love the recipes cook. that we be cooking to. They're easy, they're fast and easy. And most Anybody can do it. Since they're delicious. Like, let's listen It's really honest. good. And we, we, you don't even. You see it? Get you the great value bread. There's nothing wrong with it. I would have got the great value bread of this if I could have found it, but I didn't <laughs> find it. I didn't see any of them. But honestly, we can show y'all how to really like cook some good food. So, like I said, y'all need to stay tuned for those because those are coming. Promise you, they are coming. As long as we don't have no problems with no uploading issues, but they're coming. <laughs> <laughs> so that's all we have today. Um, I know this was a quick little video. But we have more content coming, as you know, you know, some, some skincare, some hair, you know, it's coming. Okay, it's in the mix, it's in the mix. Just bear with us, y'all, bear Please, with us. Please, we're trying to get this thing going. But if you like this video, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe, and share with your friends. But we'll see y'all in the next video.